it's happening. Oh my god, it is happening. So, <laughs> approximately 10 years ago, I was traumatized by the death of my favorite anime character. Then I got locked out of one account, uh, I got a couple of strikes on another account. I started over, I rebuilt, and here we are again for some Dragon Ball Z. Now, I want to thank everybody. Nobody uh, spoiled anything that has happened subsequent to where we stopped before. People have been incredibly supportive in catching us back up as I was going back through the previous videos. And while we don't have the audience that we had before, we have uh, the important people. So, without further ado, actually, there's going to be some further ado. Uh, and what I want to talk about was actually the Jungian archetypes. So for people who don't know, the young and archetypes... No, I'm just kidding. Uh, so here we go. This is Dragon Ball Z. I have no idea what's coming. I don't know how it's going to hit me when I get back to this and see, remember what actually happened to my boy. But again, thank you. Here we are. Dragon Ball Z. Season something, uh, episode 97. Oh, that's right. He went blonde. He went blonde. Uh, and there are no subtitles. Okay. One second. He said it, the Super, the Super Saiyan. Oh, I forgot, I have to skip the title screen because they give away, like, what happens in the episode. Oh, it's the... That's, uh, Rice. And then there's pickles or whatever. Who cares about Dende? Stop mentioning Dende. Oh, is that from the movie thing or whatever? Oh, wait, no. That happened in the show, didn't it? Oh, yeah, that's, uh, he hit him with a spirit bomb or something. Remember, guys, I've only ever seen the episodes of Dragon Ball Z one time. Did he call him the same monkey scumbag? <laughs> oh, I forgot about the battle power thing. NANI?! <laughs> That's what I was waiting for. Handle it, Goku. He's got a ring on his spaceship. Damn straight. Whoa, what was that? <laughs> oh, that's, uh, that's Freeze's ship. Oh, okay. Did he just blow up the planet?
と待てお主生きておるのか、えー、ご承知だとは思いますが私の、right. His voice isn't completely and utterly ludicrous in the sub version. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. Wait, it hasn't stopped. I thought it was the end. <laughs> Full power, new Duracells, it's about to go down. Okay, oh, there it is, yep. There it is. Oh my god, it is、uh, weird being back on the bicycle. I think it flipped over the handlebars. I forgot to talk. I forgot that I was supposed to be commentating what's going on. But so now、uh, we are just stepping right back into this thing. It feels like being in the deep end. We've got an antagonist and a protagonist, and they have to modify you know,、uh, the formula to the extent that they can while letting it continue. I would love to know how many episodes altogether Frieza was the antagonist in the midst of this. Because it seems like it's been going for a while. But Gohan was sufficiently penitent for.、Uh, His lost comrade, so I appreciate that. You've got Chi Chi still doing nothing, and then Kami and whoever, oh, Mr. The Popo or whatever,、uh, are looking for the Dragon Ball, so that's presumably going to help at some point. Story structure wise,、uh, we need some plot <laughs> to be able to actually do some analysis on that because.、Uh, I think they just kind of floated around for the vast majority of that episode. So we'll see. Next one. Season 3, episode 98. Here we go. Goku getting some work done. I really want Frieza to die by like Mortal Kombat fatality. Like rip his spine out and then bash his head on the ground and take a selfie or whatever happens in those things. Oh my gosh, Frieza, can we just. <laughs> Imagine if like football games went this way. <laughs> the Buffalo Bills are like,、oh, you've only seen 60% of my power. <laughs> Did somebody start a timer? We only had, we had five minutes, that's all we had. He's baning. I do sometimes miss the days of just the traveling shenanigans. Oh, that's Goku. Why does it say weighty for? <laughs>
Don't remind me of that. Oh, don't show. Oh my god. Happy thoughts. Happy thoughts. Ice cream. A fresh cut lawn. My hero. I mean, Goku has a point, though, because it's not like he's going to often be able to find people as strong as Frieza. What a badass. Because, of course, there's no story arc while all of this is actually happening. It's functionally the same thing. And it looks cool. They've got, uh, you know, different colors coming in to adjust the aesthetic of the interaction. But it's still essentially the same thing. <laughs> the episode was 20 minutes, you liar. It's been up for a while. There it is. Okay, it's Goku versus Frieza. And uh, since this is the inaugural episode of Goku versus Frieza, and we haven't seen it yet before, then there are a lot of structural elements to talk about, such as the archetype of protagonists and antagonists and hero story, and the need to draw out uh, such a robust antagonist. I mean, this guy has been it for quite a while now. Quality character, quality fight, I love that they get to be interesting with how they engage in this particular battle. But like I said, there are no, no new plot or character related elements. We saw Goku again doing something that's detrimental to himself, potentially very detrimental to himself because of his competitive spirit and that being a character trait, which is awesome. I mean, that's a really awesome aspect of, of Goku. On Frieza's part, it does seem like it's a caricatured antagonist at this point because his only interest is just escalation, escalation. We don't have any particular psychological characteristics that are undergirding his efforts to wipe out Goku. So, uh, yeah, uh, it just looks great, looks fantastic, such cool character design, and we are still resolving this. This is two episodes after they thought they killed him, two full episodes after that still squaring off uh, at the beginning of this encounter. So, we will see if Goku ever gets to exact revenge on this guy. If he does not, I will go ballistic. Uh, so hopefully he gets to do that and it will be super satisfying, but we shall see. Thank you very much. See you next time.